What is up? I mean, Neely's Landing, Missouri. Neely's. The, the word is so odd. But anyway, I gotta pee. I just seen a uh, um a picture of a bunch of black women, well, black girls in high school wearing six thirteen blonde weave. And under it, let me go to it. A girl said, these girls are still in high school. Ain't no reason why they should have blonde hair. What the elf happened to, to school dress codes? So somebody else come in and said, girl, this hair is literally just blonde. Y'all old people be so miserable. It's a new generation. They go wear new stuff. And I said that to Nakira. And Nakira was like, oh. And I'm like, yeah, we old, girl. We are old. We're old. Let me start with my paperwork from yesterday. And then we just go go all the way back. Because I'm missing a lot of paperwork. But yeah. So people, so people were, um, people were in her comments, but were quoting the tweet. And they was like, blonde is a natural hair color. Da, 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 da. Yeah. And blonde could be a natural hair color for black people. Y'all. I just don't want to sound like a hater, but it's like, bro. Why? Like, what are these? My thing is, if you wearing blonde 613 hair in school right now. What are y'all going to look forward to in when y'all, when, when they become like adults, like you in your early twenties, you going to be, they going to be burnt out. Like they going to be like, Oh, I've been there, did that. Like you know what? I feel like I sound crazy, so I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just shut up because, you know, I'm old. Which is wild. Okay, so. Columbus, Ohio. Okay, yeah. We gonna do this first. Okay, I'm going to just say this. So, 10 years ago when I was in high school, we barely even wore weave, let alone 613. 613 was just out of the question. We didn't wear weave. It's 10 years later, and it's middle schoolers wearing weave. So, 10 years from now, it's going to be elementary kids wearing a 12-inch that look like a 22 inch on a regular person no a 20 inch gonna look like a go look short on a regular person but it's gonna be it's gonna be elementary kids wearing 12 inches of hair touching their butt and it's just certain things that are unacceptable i guess i'm just old bro i know one thing for sure and two things for certain my child ain't fit to be wearing no 613 buzz down middle part and you in high school we wearing natural baby now if they like even if even if i let my child wear so i didn't start wearing so ends until i was like 17 something like that y'all it's just this new generation they this new generation is just accepting anything I'm talking about anything. Anything, bro. And it scared me. If we accept the any and everything, just imagine the future. And I would speak on, um, you know, I'm going to just say this. I know somebody who was giving their child, they gave their child a sewing at five. 
I ain't even gonna say that because I don't even want no beef. I'm gonna, I'm I ain't gonna edit that out, but uh, I'm definitely. It's just, it's too much. It's way too much. It is way too much, bro. I'm seeing 13 year olds with weave and like my what are they going to look forward to when they 22 they probably gonna be burnt out and they probably gonna go natural and where they what they natural hair for the rest of their life because they tired of weave like i used to be so upset and that's another thing i need to stop comparing my upbringing in my generation to this generation oh i sound old i sound so old it's just i want i want these little girls to be excited about life like i want them to be excited about their first sewing i want them to be excited about you know wearing blonde hair when they get when these girls get 22 I, I'm, I'm not even going to say 22. If you wear sewings in middle school, you going to be tired of life at around 16, 17. Tired. Done. Everything going to be boring. You done did everything you wanted to do. Child. 6.44 a.m. Where was I 6.44 a.m.? Oh, yeah, I was. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was it here? No, this is Laredo, Texas. Oh. This is old. What is this from? Yeah. And and the girls, they look beautiful. Don't get me wrong on that. I ain't even they look good with their lashes. They look good. I'm not even stunned on it. Okay, yeah, this is the one I need. They look good. Like, I ain't, like, ain't no issue with that at all. But it's like, dang, bro. Six, th I didn't start wearing blonde weave like that until I was 22. I think my first 613 hair that I, I, and I think I dyed it myself. I don't even think I bought it. I dyed it that blonde. I think I dyed it, like, two or three times to get it that light. And to see, yeah, this is the one I need. And to see You know what? <laughs> this world, this world gonna be crazy as hell in about ten years. Because I've been I've been seeing on the internet people saying Oh, I messed this up. Lord not paying attention oh well i done seen people on the internet man it's crazy always co-signing bs and oh i didn't miss this all the way up girl let me just put this in here See, I'm so I'm so thrown off. I really need to be minding my business because that's all there is. But um, and this ain't even about men because men men will sexually assault anywhere from men will sexually assault women anywhere from being months being 
six months old to 86 year old so i'm not even gonna bring men into this because men they do not care it's just damn like i just wish I just wish mothers would slow their kids down. I wish black mothers would slow their babies down. Like, it's going to be a time and a place to wear a weave and lashes and makeup. I mean, my God. It's, it's a whole lot of jokes saying, I'm glad I went to school. The time frame that I went to school because these kids, they at school with Balenciaga and design and name brand and you know, it's a lot of kids out here that can't even afford that. They just, you know, they look, they, you know, they, they mom probably shop at Target or Walmart or which Walmart has really stepped their game up. Like, if you know how to dress, then um, you can make Walmart look like Balenciaga. To be real, I just wish black women would slow these kids down, just because social media just because these kids see everything on social media doesn't mean that they have to have it i bet i bet being a parent i bet being a parent in today's age is is low-key heartbreaking because it's like bro these kids they trying to keep up with social media and It's sad. It really is. But y'all, but y'all know I'm old, so honestly, what do I know? Okay. August 11th. Where was I? What was I doing? August 11th. August 11th. August 11th. August 11th. I think I was in Texas. What time it was? 4:43 p.m. Now I got out of work. That was I picked up a load. I think I took a picture. Two one. I don't think this is. Where did I take this to? Oh yeah, yeah yeah yeah. Okay, doll. It was. Um yeah, McCormick. Okay. I just, bruh. In 10 years, it's going to, well, right now, right now, it's already middle, middle schoolers. It's already middle schoolers wearing sewing. So, in 10 years, we feel to have babies in daycare wearing uh, sewing. But you know what? I'm going to finish this video off and I'm going to say this. Time always repeats itself. Time always repeats itself. When I say time always repeats itself, it's going to get to a point. It's going to get to a point in the black community where people going to stop buying their kids weaves. And kids just going to have to rock this shit out naturally. It's it's go it's gonna be a time, period. It is going to be a time. We y'all know they're saying we had a time last night. It's gonna be a time. Everything always repeats itself, and my generation, no, nah, we don't we don't play that. A lot of us. A lot of us don't play that. A lot of people do play that. But I know my peers, we not, no, we not fit to have our kids dressing up in fashion over baby shit and win 613 bust down middle parts in middle school. You crazy as hell. That's all. That's my rent for today. <laughs>